hitting a three-year low, beans down a 19-month low. What, is, what does that secular issue mean? Well, uh, I think it means we're just retreating from the, the drought-driven highs when we had the short crops last year. So we're coming back to prices that are more in line with the prior years, but we're still quite elevated from, say, the 2005 and six level. You know, Greenhaven, we sort of have our own little index for the grains, which is one bushel of corn, one of wheat, and one of soybeans. And since the, the price advance have ranged from, say, 18 to $32. And right now, I think that basket in the front is about $24. So we think there's not much more downside there. Corn could come a little bit lower uh, as we move to harvest, but we think that pretty much the discounting has taken place. So how does this affect an equal weighted fund in terms of your own performance? You can't really make shifts, or can you? Well, we don't make shifts in the, in the allocations. As you know, we track your Thompson Reuters continuous commodity index of 17 commodities equally weighted. And because the index is rebalanced every day, we rebalance the fund every day. So if a commodity is, let's say, strong, like crude today, if it's stronger than others, we'll be selling some crude this afternoon to bring it back to 117th. If um, corn is weak on a given day relative to the others, we would buy a little corn. So we're every day really, like the name, the continuous index, we're trimming it up to be equal weight every day.